everybody Adi Furata is coming back season three I think like next season coming up this like July maybe I'm wrong but French roll final got an official trailer with English subs let's check it out okay the shitty humans no it's October okay it's fall not summer this is Shea's backstory, right? This is the messed up things I think the anime like cut out. I I, I remember when we were uh, check out the playlist by the way for the audio for the reactions. But before we met Shea, I I remember a lot of people saying, "Yo, these bunny people, they're not as just like happy go lucky comedy just like you see in the anime because they skipped a lot of the actual really messed up things that happened before." I'll show you how weak this closet fangs will be. Oh. My girl, she's a cool. Oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. Fuck you, Koki. Koki, you fucking suck. But oh my goodness. She's, that's Shizuku, right? I see it. I, I don't even need to see the face. This is Shizuku right here. Boom. Boom. It's gotta be right. Is it not? Never mind. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. It's a bunny girl. It's wrong. Okay, who is this? So, Shea's friends? I don't remember seeing her in the village before. Boss. Princess Vivi. Oh, what the fuck is go more creepy as shit going on? So, I think that at the end of season two, we left to go to like the capital of the empire or something. Right? We're going to the actual empire, and I was like, what the hell? Where were we staying the entire time? I thought that was basically the entire major kingdom, but it's like, nah, we're going to an empire, and then this is probably some kind of royal, right? Princess Liliana is the princess from our side that was skipped in season one, but actually was shown in season two, right? Just like self-inserted. And then this is some cre- yeah, that's her, right. What is this dude doing, bro? Ew. Creepy as shit. <laughs> <laughs> this just reminded me of irregular at Magic High School with uh, the seven star tournament or something at in the first season when everyone's trying to dance with Tatsuya and every girl's like, please, they're all just sitting on the side, bro. And, 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 and Yui gets the main girl. Of course, me use the main girl. So we got, you know, Tio's looking nice, Shay's looking nice. This cowdy form. Oh, I mean, she's getting carried by Noint. Right? This ain't Cowdy, bro. This is Noin's body that's carrying Cowdy, and she's looking all fine as hell. Right there. I don't think that we've seen much of Shizuku wanting Hajime or thirsting over as the arrested the girls in the earlier two seasons, but this is indirectly confirming it right here. Why do you care, Shizuku? We want the empire to crumble? So what is the Hauria? Uh, is that some kind of... Is, is that the nobles? It's not Princess Liliana's last name, right? Or this is referring to the bunny girls. The bunny clan? Okay, so the backstory with the empire fucking us up. So we're gonna crumble the empire within. Okay. Oh my god, the bunny people, dude! Remember in season one, when we left them, they were so cute and adorable. Then we put them through severe training, then they turned into fucking brutal monsters. So we got an entire army of them now. Hajime's new drip, man. This is actually looking sick. Say what you will. Okay, so it's coming autumn. Who says autumn, bro? Autumn isn't a real season. It's it's spring, summer, fall, winter. Who the fuck says autumn? Anyways, it's coming in in like 2024 October-ish, right? So 
as as much as people hate on Adi Furata, I think that the CGI is trash, but there's some really good moments here and there. In season three's plotline, we're going into a completely new territory, the Empire, we're bringing them down, the motivation connects back to the bunny people. This is looking pretty hype. I'm pretty excited for this. Hope you guys check it out. If you're new here, check out the playlist. We got season one and season two all covered, plus any news, cut light novel content.